Hello, I'm First Alert Meteorologist David Reese on your side with your Monday forecast for WRBL.com. And we are looking at a prolonged dry stretch. Here's a look at our cloud cast showing another cold front moving into the deep south tomorrow afternoon for your Monday. Around 2 o'clock, so not all that bad. Monday looking pretty good. Tuesday, notice a dry frontal passage, so no rain in the forecast. Tuesday either as high pressure settles in across most of the country. The only place that's the exception to that rule, well, off to our west, across the desert southwest in the Four Corners region, and also the northeast. In fact, the northeast could be rather miserable here over the next several days as several inches of rain could fall off that way. But what's it looking like here locally? Well, here's the seven-day rain totals from the European model, and this is the only model showing rain in the longer term and that's because it develops an area of low pressure there in the northern Gulf of Mexico fling some moisture back off to the north now one of the other computer models the GFS one of the American models it actually has that same low pressure system a little bit farther to the south closer to south Florida so if you go somewhere in between we're still right on the very cusp and then right on the razor thin ed edge there of seeing some rain maybe maybe by next Sunday, but it's not enough of a push to call for any chance of rain. Really, I just put a little bit more cloud cover in for Sunday, but just know next weekend could be a little bit up in the air depending on what happens off to our south in the Gulf of Mexico. But other than that, next seven days, not a whole lot to talk about. I mean, the warmest day of the bunch is going to be Tuesday, and then after that, very fall-like weather with cool, crisp mornings with lows in the mid to upper 40s and beautiful afternoons with highs in the middle 70s. So enjoy this nice dry stretch.